Server Technology makes power distribution equipment and monitoring solutions for the data center market. Hello, hello, SPM users. This is Linda with Server Technology, and this video shows you how to use the enhanced features of SPM's great email system to configure the SMTP server, test emails, generate a disclaimer message, and set up recipients and email groups. Wow, a lot of useful email actions. Let's get going. Part 1, Email Setup. The Email Server tab allows you to configure SMTP server settings, and you can also test the email function and provide a text message or a disclaimer, whatever you want to say, in the footer of every outgoing email. The Email Address tab lets you set up recipient email addresses. Note that if you upgraded to SPM 6.1 from a previous SPM version, the email address list here will already be populated with the same addresses that were set up in the previous version. If you are new to SPM 6.1 or later, you'll have to add the addresses you want manually. Whether migrated or added, addresses will display throughout email setup and later in alarm policies. To add a recipient, click the new email icon. And you can set an optional shortcut, a quick visual tool for long lists of addresses. And you can select recipients for conveniently placing in a group using the Email Group tab. To add a group, click the new Email Group icon. Name the group and drag names from the list on the right to the left pane to include as members of the new group. Okay, now that you have your email infrastructure in place with the server, people, and email groups, what's next? See the Part 2 video to learn how to set up customized alarm policies and use your email settings to alert recipients and escalate your message when a device alarm occurs. Nice, this is why SPM rocks. If you have questions, we are ready to assist you at support at servertech.com. Stay powered. Be supported. Get ahead. Server Technology, your power strategy experts.